Today we test the human airbag. Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. As anyone who has seen a crash test dummy video knows, an airbag can provide a crucial layer of added protection when you're on the road. Mm-hmm, you know what else is uh, considered added protection? Not having sex. Oh, that's right. Remember, it is celibacy week. Cool. You were saying? Yes, I was saying. When airbags, well, in the car, they're no doubt great, but you know there's now airbags that exist without the car, yes. just for the human. Yes, I yes, do know that. The human airbag, it looks like a vest. It's a wearable, near full body airbag to protect us when we fall. Mm hmm and if we didn't try this thing out ourselves, we just wouldn't be doing our jobs. It's time for Tall Boys Go Boom, testing the human airbag. Okay, Ian and Anthony, before we blow you up, I'm gonna show you a couple of official videos from S Airbag, which is the company we purchased these products from. So let's take a look at this first one. S airbag. Human airbag protection. Oh, what? oh is that paja pajamas? <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa it's, it's my goodness. Did you see his head the turned into head. a marshmallow? And and it full head protection, oh, full so head protection, complete neck support. What else you got? Top whoa, shoulder protection? I no. need this. Whoa, but no bottom shoulder. Okay, all right. You gotta got leave something out. Whoa, that's an interesting fall. <laughs> yeah. Pretty stiff, Mr. That's Mannequin. how I fall. I just stay completely oh, straight. Timber. I guess if you really got this suit on, you're like really trusting it, so you don't have to try to catch yourself at all. I am super interested in this because I have injured all of these things. Hips, backs, collarbones, heads, I've pelvis. I've broken I've broken some stuff, injured some things, and fallen a lot. Well, I typically spend a lot of time trying not to fall, so maybe I can be wearing this and have, not have to worry about that anymore. This would be new, a new level of freedom. Now, it's not cheap. Uh, these things are 1169, <laughs> and that's a 1169 per airbag with four extra cartridges. And we bought two of these? Yeah, we did. So I hope yeah. so that turn, we get some views on this video. Turn that ad blocker off. <laughs> Please. Um, of course, it's usually for seniors. That's how they're marketing it. Right? And I don't mean high school seniors, I mean old folk. Yeah. Because, I mean, this is the true story. So the CEO of S Airbag, Mr. Sue, his grandfather passed away from an accidental fall. That happens all the time. It, it does You happen. get old, you fall, and that could be the beginning of a decline. And so this is a way not only to make a fashion statement, but not have that happen to you. So you give it to your Nana, and then you, you call her every day, and you're like, Nana, you've been wearing your- You think you get Nana to wear this airbag? Thing? Hell no. Uh, She'd be like, oh yeah, I, I put on this vest every time I decide to walk somewhere. Well, and the thing that I was interested in in watching this thing deploy was, I've, I've seen a video of this thing like on TikTok and I thought that maybe you had like a little remote control or something that you hit. I'm falling! <laughs> no, it's not. But no, it's, it's there's a gyroscope in there, right? That basically it knows the angle that you're falling and the speed that you're falling and then boom, it activates and catches you just in time. Yeah, so at this point, you should be feeling, I think, pretty solid about uh, testing these things out, except for the fact that we paid over $2,000 for them. Yeah. Right. Um, Curious. But, but. Uh, I did want to show you another one of the company's official videos uh, before we do that. Here, here we go. Oh, okay. Uh, That's a problem. Where's his head? Not having a head. Where's his clothes? You fall slower, though, when you're naked without it. That, hold on. Okay, hold, hold, hold on. <laughs> hold on. Hold on now. That doesn't make me feel great. I, is it that you need to have a head or that it doesn't work? Yeah. I, what, what are we supposed to do with that? Well, the thing is, is that you both have heads, so I, I think you'll yeah. be okay. And I'm wearing pants. Good gracious. Well, okay, now let's do it. Welcome to the hope we don't fall, but if we do, it'll be okay because of this vest zone. Hopefully. We have trust issues with this thing, so to decide who is going to test it out first, we're first gonna test it out on these dozen eggs and predict how many are gonna break. Whoever's closest to the right answer gets to go second. And technically it's how many more will break because just a moment ago, Link dropped the eggs and two of them broke. <laughs> So we have 10 eggs that are unbroken, and I predict that it's gonna work, it's gonna be fine, 
and no more eggs are gonna break. So I'm saying two is my guess, the existing two. Well, you, that's what I was gonna say. Okay, well, I went So first. now you need to change. Just say any, any eggs at all break and you win. All right, some other eggs are gonna break. Okay. At least one, so that's one. Okay, so to activate this thing, we snap it. So that turns it on. Grandma's playing her song again. Yeah, she is. Uh, there we go. Okay. All right, I'm gonna let you toss it. You're dripping a little bit. Oh, really? Well, that's the egg that already broke. <laughs> so, uh, this is our crash pad for us later. So I'm just gonna kind of throw you it throw up it on the, the floor and just let right it hit here. right on the ground, right? I mean, and it should know. Start upright. So it, it, and then it falls, you know? It's gotta think it's falling. Okay, here we go. Grandma? You okay? Grandma. It didn't uh it didn't deploy. Your vest didn't work today. So uh but did any of them break? Did any more eggs break? We this is this the patch from Well, even though you just threw it down, did that egg break? That, yeah, it did. Yeah. Broke. Okay. You All gotta right. go first. Oh gosh. Which now it doesn't we, even work. <laughs> it's not gonna work at all. <gasps> you first. <laughs> Okay. Uh, All right, buddy. I don't like You're falling. Going first. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna do some practice falls, but I don't even like practice falling. I mean, I'm falling onto Seriously? these things. The last time I fell, I don't even remember it. It's it's mushy, man. Well, it's kind of mushy. Uh, it's like you know, stop. Oh, uh, uh, you go. You did it. It's the most nervous stunt guy I've ever seen. <laughs> okay, uh, should I do a, a jump and roll like that? Uh, you when should I, fall like an old lady. Hey, where's the good fishing spot? <laughs> Are you? We're at the trout bagging today. That's what you look like a fisherman. That's why I'm talking about that. But listen, huh? You feel better I'm now? I'm nervous. I'm still but, nervous. But then do another one. No, I'm good. I'm gonna put my. Show me how you're gonna fall. You try different things. Well, you and... watch me. What's the coolest one? The one, <laughs> the one where you just kind of like. Just, just this Like a truss fall on your back. Yeah, do it. One more time. What? Yeah. There you go. And then like this? I just stay like this? Yeah, uh -huh. stay like that. Now come on. All right. Sit here. <laughs> <laughs> hey, mine's not it's activated. Okay. I need this. I need this to work. Turn around. All right. So then you zip up. Kind of zip up. Zip up. Look like you're going fishing. Yeah. Oh, now. All right, so it's activated. All right, Brett, you ready? Let's do a countdown. Um, oh, we're gonna do a countdown. I'm more nervous with this thing on. Like a three, I know, because it's gonna explode around you. You think it's really gonna do it? I mean, Pete, you know, when people are in a car accident with an airbag, it can break their nose. It'll save their life. This might break some innards. Break a rib or something. Okay, you ready? Well, we're gonna count down from three and then you're gonna say something that an old lady would say while she's falling. Okay, count. Three, two, one. Oh, Nelly! <laughs> <laughs> Come on, S airbag. I know what the S stands for. Well, Grandma's not doing well. Come on, try again. Fall down. Fall down. Oh! <laughs> what the crap? You were just running. You weren't even. Running. Let me tell you, it's uh, it's a little alarming. It's a little alarming. It is. Holy moly! You weren't. You were just running. Did you get that? Did you get that? Come on. Hey. You smell that? <laughs> did, you, did you crack your pants? <laughs> oh my god, that was amazing! Well, you look awesome. How do I look? <laughs> now, I mean, you weren't even falling. I was about to do an awesome thing. Fall, fall now and see if it feels better. <laughs> well, how does that feel? I mean, it feels fine. <laughs> Did you think you were shot? Dude, 
it's crazy. It's just like, whoo! It's like, it's like the biggest fart you've ever left. You look like a popcorn kernel. <laughs> he does. I mean, uh, I can't wait for you to experience it. Just start running. I mean, what? So gr- grandma's gonna be like, I gotta get my prunes, and then it's just gonna pop. Yeah, think about that. Like, grandma falls, she gets up, everybody's checking on her. She's like, I'm fine. I'm, I know I'm the. Yeah, that's. What? I mean, why doesn't Nana just keep it like that all the time? I don't. It looks great. Right. Yeah. I'm a bit afraid. Yeah, me too. (laughs) Did anything fly off anywhere? No. I mean, it was so fast. All right. right. I'm going to go for it now. Where are the pockets? (laughs) Hold my glasses. What kind of fall are you going to do? I'm going to do the fall that you were going to do. Okay. I'm just going to fall backwards. It is freaking nervous. Yeah, it is. Why am I so nervous? Because that sounded like a ballistic explosion. It was very loud. (laughs) You'll be fine. (laughs) I'm an old man! (laughs) Run! (laughs) Nothing. (laughs) Okay, don't run. Get up slowly. Get up slowly. Grandma, get up slowly. Okay. Now, do a bigger, do a bigger jump. Like, do one where you jump in a. Yeah. I mean, she's going to die one way or another. Yeah, she did. Oh, my God. And somebody else is going to have a heart attack. Just, oh, my Grandpa's going to die watching her. Y'all, that I, is... You were like... Give me my glasses. <laughs> give, me my, give me my glasses. Well, so far, so good. Oh. 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 <laughs> did it get you? It's pretty I gotta calm, I gotta calm down. It's, I mean, at what point did it deploy? <laughs> and, and, and what's happening to mine? And then after this, Grandma can get in the pool and just float. <sighs> Let's do it again. Yeah! Hey, have you been tracking your regional soda over at the sport.com burp bracket? Well, you should go over there because you can also vote. You can vote to send yours to the end. Go to, over there, sports.com. Keep talking about that because I don't want to do this. Yeah, again. I'm a little bit nervous. Uh, but here's the thing. We think that potentially what went wrong, because <laughs> something did go wrong, is that these are super smart vests. Right? Mm-hmm. We're going to give S Air the benefit of the doubt. Not a sponsor. Super smart vests. They knew that we were messing around, that we're just practicing. I think we have to make a realistic falling situation, and it will sense this is actually happening, and it will deploy. Okay, so the scenario is it is New Year's Eve at the retirement home, Uh and the grannies are getting tipsy. And instead of the apple dropping at midnight... The apple. it's It's not an apple? I thought the ball was an apple, too. It used to be an apple. Instead of the thing that falls, falling, it's the grannies, grannies that are falling. Grannies are falling. Yeah. So let's plug her up. Grannies fall, then the panties fall. Uh, uh, Am I right? Uh, All right, so plug this thing up. Let's activate it. God, I don't want to do this again. I feel like it might just go off as soon as I plug it in. <laughs> okay. All right, so we're going to do a countdown, and we're going to fall. You guys do a countdown from 10, like it's New Not Year's 10. Eve. Not 10. Do it from 3. Hold on. We get to the front, and you're going to fall on this part. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm going to fall. Let me see. On that part. We're going to hit each other. No, we're not going to hit each other. All right. Oh, it's about to be New Year's. 3, 2, 1. Yay! Oh! 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 Yes! 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 Yes!
we survived! We survived! <laughs> That's how we feel. Another year! Woo! Another Woo! year at home! Woo! They worked so well that time. <laughs> we didn't even have to run around. Yeah, now we can't run around. Hey! hey. <laughs> All right, thanks for subscribing and clicking that bell. And not having sex. <laughs> Because remember, it's celibacy, celibacy week. week. Keep it in your pants. Don't make the beast with two backs. Nope. You know what time it is. Hi, my name is Sophie. I'm a Swede living in Norway. I recently slipped on some ice and broke my wrist, so I've been signed off from work for a whole month. Thank you, GMM, for keeping me company. Now it's time to spin the wheel of mythicality. <sighs> Sophie, we've got the product for you. Yeah, I don't know, actually. <laughs> Click the top link to watch us guess what older celebrities our crew members drew in Good Mythical More. And to find out where the Will of Mythicality is going to land. Head to sports.com to vote in the regional soda burp bracket.